All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So, today is Monday? Yeah, <laughs> Monday. And we're using Trading. So, uh, this open hand's not too terrible. I can just go ahead and pitch this so if somehow I get a door a second turn. But I have a first turn Fortress MST, Forbidden Chalice, the, the, the Crane. So, I'll go ahead and search for Night Express Knight. Overall, not a terrible hand. Uh, my opponent here is just going to set one card and pass. I hope that one card is really good, or I hope that, you know, Tago doesn't have an MST, because, you know, generally, Tago kicks up out. I mean, I have the MST, <laughs> but my opponent here is Stan Marsh, so, dueling against the South Park character. <laughs> Alright, pitch, special. I read his effect. So, of course, uh, this upcoming Sunday, Cyber Dragons will be on the series, but, uh, I'm gonna try to, you know, for out the last few kinks in it, we're thinking about, you know, uh, breaking out of the norm in which instead of, uh, instead of, you know, my, you know, my partner going first, that I would be the one to go first, because, you know, and then choose second, so my opponent would go play their monster, so I can then special summon, like, my Cyber Dragons and my Solar Wind Jammers, because, uh, it's going to be a pretty big chance, you know, that if I go, it'll be like, you know, my opponent, my partner, my other opponent, then me, or, you know, or my partner, my opponent, then me, then, you know, I'd pretty much have to have Stu or, uh, Stanzi straight up not summon anything on their turn to, uh, get off on my, whoa, what is this card? I've never seen it before. Okay. This card is treated as Umi, 600 attack. You can have a monster you control, you can go. Getting levels equal to the number of water monsters you currently control. Okay. Never seen that card before, but they quit, so they're back. Alright, back again. So, uh, something interesting, if you want to know. I actually figured out a way to kinda auto put annotations, because. As you guys know, I have an end card now, and the end card seems, it, it, it literally sometimes, it just takes fucking forever to set up. Like, it takes me at least, it took me at least five or six minutes to do each annotation, the, you know, end card, because the end card, then I have to put all six annotations for each series, then the sub button, and, you know, that's like five or six minutes times the, you know, the three to four videos that go up, you know, it just takes a cool minute to do, you know. And I was just like, oh my god, is there any way? And I was like, oh, well, is there, is there like, you know, auto annotation in, in YouTube? And they're like, nope, you gotta do it yourself. And then someone posted, uh, like, a like comment on the forum thing. I was like, yeah, if you just use this program, follow this YouTube video. Bam. It took me a fucking forever. And it's like a complicated sequence. I, I probably think about putting up a, a, a video about it. You know, it'll probably be a separate video. I hate that play. I hate, I, I hate that play. Like... Like, oh, Venus, Summer Shine Balls, gotcha, like, and, like, ooh, 2,000 attack Venus, I'm shaking in my boots, like, I swear to God, like, when that was one of the most predominant plays in Agents, the shit just pissed me off, you know, like, I would rather, you know, see some plays done, wow, you're going super ham, and there's nothing happened, I hope you get regeki and once you go into Gachi, you're just gonna fucking just leave the Shine Balls there, fine, leave them there, who cares, like, <sighs> yeah, seriously. Just leave the side ball there, you know? Or whatever his name is. Dark Mist? I don't know. I didn't I didn't I didn't watch Zexel. I didn't. I'm watching Arc 5, but not Zexel. Oh, gotta be careful, don't mention Arc 5. I can get a freaking uh copyright strike like that one time. That was stupid. Anyway, I'll probably put up just a separate video about it. I'm not gonna teach you guys how to do it. I will link the video, but by the time this video goes up, I'll either decide that to do it or not to do it, so this is probably just sounding redundant at this point. I'm just happy that, you know, I figured it out, that literally at the click of a button, all of a sudden, the, the computer just crawls control itself and just blops all my annotations, like the only thing I had to do was just put the time, the correct time. You know, I could, I could do the time and say like the last, you know, 15, 14 seconds, but, you know, that was a little bit too complicated, so I'm just like, you know what, fine, I'll just put the time, but it puts everything, it puts the, the title, the link, it's everything, so. And I'm like super happy about that. Tiger's using that soul charge. He can't attack this turn, but seems like he's gonna do much more than just attack. He probably could pull off a lot more plays. Alright, tribute him again. Search for the next position. 
play the expedition. I mean, he's going off of his plays right now. I know Tiago's got a plan. Hope he doesn't fucking just make our opponent scoop. I actually want to get some action. I actually want to duel. Did I even look at my hand? I don't even think I've seen my hand yet. Yeah, I don't think I've even seen my hand. Okay. So, I'm going to Galkiai's Tachyon. Go into uh, full armor. Full armor can destroy the Hyperion. Yep. Huh. Yeah, I mean, I probably look okay. 4,000 beater, get to go ahead and destroy. Face up. This is another effect. Once per turn, you can target up to two equipped. Equip to this card. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> A weird card. They don't even have any like English art. They could probably create the English art on like you know Yu Gi Oh card maker. Like just take the art, just take the picture, put the right name, you know, put the right text in English. Like, it's not that hard. But they're just like, no, nah, we're too lazy. We're just gonna keep it as the freaking Japanese card art. We still haven't even got this card. We got. Funny thing is, this card came out before Dark Matter, and, and we got this, and we got Dark Matter first. Okay. So, uh, there goes your normal summon, unless you have, like, Honest or something, because you only get that effect when you, by tributing a Light Sworn monster, so. Celestia, I have not seen her in a cool minute. Not people, not really, you don't really need to play her anymore. You drop on Gardner? Yeah, Gardner and Bless, and then you can get Regeki, okay. That goes a chunk out of our life points. I, say, I don't like the idea of Light Swords almost being back at full power. Like, what? Are, the only thing they're missing is the, like, the third Honest and their soul, third uh, Charger Light Brigade. Hopefully, Konami doesn't put Charger Light Brigade to three next format. The old well, next list, because that's just going to be dumb. Like, oh my god. No, I'm not a big fan of that. The deck is pretty, pretty sacky dropping JD. Even though that shouldn't be too much. If I can summon a Dora, then you know, what's a JD? <laughs> Just detach, make myself unaffected, and then you can fucking wipe until his face turns blue. He's still not gonna get me. So, hmm. Hmm. Oh, well, I might as well play the terraforming from deck then. Now, what I, what I do after that is questionable. Think about just taking the duel slow, like summoning gear frame, search, you know, discard special. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll take the duel slow. I don't need to go into a first turn door right now. I can go into door later. So, I can just kill these two. Actually, I might just kill a Shine Ball just so he can't go into a Gachi. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure how much you stay and guys gonna get out of her. You gotta also make sure that you don't you don't get exactly, you know, five fairies. So I'll probably kill yeah, if I kill a Shine Ball and kill you know have exactly f I mean four four. Gotta make sure he doesn't get four. So yeah, I'll kill you and then I'll kill. Shine ball, really don't care with what's up with Venus. And then my opponent has a response. Gardener, alright. Okay. So you just negate our next attack, huh? Interesting. Could have waited on that. What are you doing? Please do. Oh my god, you're dumb. Wow. One, Fortress really doesn't have a fucking effect like that. Huh. 
Okay, well, I guess Fortress has to be on the Filter's Love, but like, what was the point of all of that? Like, you veiled me, but then you battle with me, but then, like, why? Why you do all of that? I don't care about you, 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 so... You can just, you know, block my next attack anyway, but I still have to attack just to get rid of the Gardner effect, so... It's fine. It's like, really? Why did, why did, why did you do all that? He did all of that, he's like, the fucking bottomless, this, 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 like... Okay. And? I just wanted to kill one of the shine balls. Just yeah, you wouldn't go Nagachi, but it seems like he might go Nagachi now. Unless he really wants to keep them shine balls there. So he still has only what two ferrets? Yeah, two, so. That's fine. What the fuck just happened? Wow! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> oh my god. Damn. Damn. This motherfucker wing dragon are raw. But you see that coming, bitch? Like, nope. <laughs> okay. Gonna get another duel in. Be right back. Alright. Yeah, doing. Wow. Raise your hand if you thought that's how that duel was gonna end. <laughs> like, yo, this man was like, and then you get the one giant of raw, like, oh shit! <laughs> yeah. Swords again. Getting real sick and fucking tired of that fucking card, I must say. I'm gonna actually get forming. You, I'll probably go ahead and just, uh, and, uh, MST the swords. Especially since we got the Royal Decree. And I'll go ahead and pitch you. I fucking know I hate swords. So goody, so goody, I want that booty. Here are them swords. <laughs> and then you get the 4,000 fist! The swords is a dumb card. <laughs> Such a double standard. Just like, oh, well, uh, you can't attack, you know? At least with Nightmare still case, neither one of us can attack. Like, no, 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 you can't attack for three turns. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Booty. <laughs> oh, Mr. J. I'm gonna make you expend some resources to get over my Malefic Cyber and Dragon. Nope, you're just gonna miss my Felt spell. That's fine. So I'm dead. <laughs> I thought I was gonna make you expend some resources, but you're just, you had the MST, so, alright. Great, Telenites. I don't care if you go up to 19, just no searchy, searchy. Inconvenience to say the least. There we go. You're pretty much out of the door because all you have is the Vega. So, uh, fuck you, Jay. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. You wanna fucking get rid of my fail spell, get rid of my shit, fuck you. Wow, Tiago. Are you shitting me? You have absolutely nothing. It's bad then. 
Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. What was this guy using? Some some plant deck, some synchro plant deck. He's got spore, so. Oh, oh, lone fire to lone fire to lone fire to the whatever. You guys know how I'll move a card to lone fire is. But hey, Konami put up to three, why not? So, lone fire. Oh, lone fire summon dandy. Okay. Spore, and summon. Level four, all right. Scrap. Oh, okay. Oh, there goes our route Curry. That sucks. Really wanted it too. That would kill. We could at least lock his partner out of the duel. Oh, that's gay. Well, we probably lose this duel. Especially with Tiago having the absolute crappiest hand ever. And the Telenite being player being at least back in the duel, so now it's pretty much two on one and I'm I'm low on resources as well. So yeah, the best fucking empty, desolent and shitty. I could summon him, tribute him, get the filth spell. Then I've already normal summon this turn. That's the problem. Uh, and with the Teller Knights and all his backgrounds back in play, probably gonna lose. Just some Dora. I can't. Yeah, tribute you, get you, summon, activate you, and go like, you know, pitch you, and then surge, but then what would that do? Fucking absolutely nothing. Absolutely fucking nothing. Alright. Alright, we're back. Tago scooped it up and I didn't know, so. Not that there was much I could have done with that hand anyway, but. Hmm. Go chase. Why would you do that? Well, why would you do that? Hmm. Mm mm. Mm mm mm. Ah, uh uh. What do you mean, uh, you're the one who did it. You don't have a monster in your grave, right? So I don't even know what the fuck you're doing. Well, you can go into like a Zen mains or something. But that was done and dumb. You could have wow and you're just gonna leave him like that, huh? Okay. I was just, mm-mm, mm-mm. Well, those chains aren't the easiest deck to play, but they're not the hardest either. And that was just booty. <laughs> He just sees Galaxy Soldier and he's just assuming it's infinity. I mean, he can go infinity, but maybe not. Depends. Like adult diapers. Depends. <laughs> well, for all you know, he's just gonna go into a Felgrin. Like, you just see Galaxy Soldier and you just assume when you, you clearly see that there's other Galaxy monsters in the deck. <laughs> wow. Wow, main decking DD Crow. When douchebags do that. I guess Madocha's out of the deck of hand traps though. It's like fine. Okay, I was flat up fed up now. It's like fine, I'll go into fucking infinity. It's like fine. I'm tired of this shit. Like I'm tired of this shit too, Tiago. I don't blame you. Get angry. Fucking DD Crow. You looking shit at me? <laughs> Fucking DD Crow, like I get Madoche's play hand trap, but there could have there's a lot of other better hand traps that you could have did. Like fucking Max Seed Valor, like why why do DD Crow just be a straight up douche? Like DD Crow's an evil card. Yeah, there's the powerful infinity. Guess you're just gonna go ahead and take his kitty cat. 
run over to Hoot Cake, which will, of course, go back to the deck, which is fine. Yep. Just. Guy goes mad. He's like, you fucking. You did that shit? You fucking did. You croaked me, you motherfucker. Tiago angry. Tiago smash. I gotta stop. <laughs> Okay, you got the Royal Decree too? Yep. Wow. That's fine. Stink right back. Okay. Good luck. You're gonna need it. <laughs> so, level one. Spore. Unknown. Well, okay. Mm-hmm. So you will summon back you. So that's six. Nope, he's just gonna go and negate him now. Like, uh, no. <laughs> Bring that key. Nope, alright. Wow, this hand is flipping awesome. I think I'll just go for a door. Yeah. Door the Explorer. Nope, without tribute. Go to Dora. Yep, and then they quit. You might as well. Alright, we'll get another Dolan. Bear back. Alright, we're back. I only got a first turn Dora once again. Like, it's so powerful. This is kind of useless because I didn't even get a field spell. Is it Shadal's? Is it Shadal's? I hope it's Shadal's. Just to see I can get mad. Oh no. It's in Jinzo Tracker. He's gonna play Monster Gate. Summon a Dark Greffer. Okay. Still surprised this card's still at 1 here in the TCG. I was a G1 to 3. So I'll probably go up to 3 next list. They're probably testing it. So, you're trying to play Jinzo deck where you're trying to get all the As long as you don't have fucking, uh, uh, Lunis card, we'll be fine, but. Summon Jinzo? Alright. And then it's dead. Interesting. <laughs> so a Jinzo deck. That is totally fine. And then they quit. Holy shit. Ah, <sighs> bear back. Alright people, welcome back. So apparently the opponent decided to allow Tiago to go first, because Tiago, you know, he's trying to show me, you know, with Cyber Dragons you you need a second. So you know his deck is way more than just Cyber Dragons and much better. <laughs> but I'll hopefully get the use the hang of the deck. You know, we're gonna have one more episode of Webcam Duel's deck this Wednesday and then I'll be moving it over. Made the thumbnail for it and everything, so it's totally ready to go. <sighs> so what are you gonna do, Chago? Pitch special nope. Go ahead and summon a die. Damn, there's that first turn infinity. That good old first turn infinity. It's not like Tiago's deck, it's, it's more than just, you know, infinity.deck. He can go into other plays that if you make an infinity.deck that you can't do. You know, he's actually running Galaxy. It's happened to be that he can just go ahead and splash some Cyber Dragons in and then bam, he has the broke ass infinity. So opponents will probably quit and they'll have to get another, 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 another duel. Yep. Does anybody even use Nova anymore? <laughs> Remember when Nova was that decent card? <laughs> now he's now he's just like, oh, I got Infinity. What's well, the card from Infinity is cool. It's just I just can't stand the fucking card because it's broken and stupid. Well, this person has no extra, so that should be interesting. Are you using something sacky? Tunes. Okay. Is there new support on here? Like King Kingdom in the hand and shit? I have no idea. No, no. 
No, he's not using tunics. He's using something sacky. Because he's gonna go tune table, tune table, tune table, and deck pen. Okay. Okay. Yep. I don't know what ECA means. Okay. Upstart. And now we just sit here and watch our opponents play with themselves. One day. Save. <sighs> oh, this hand is fun. Oh, you know what? I can't do any damage to you anyway, can I? Hmm. Yep, let's activate you. I don't care about that. You're fucking, no, you're scrub anyway, so. Thank you, pitch you. Go ahead and give me an express knight. We'll just fucking jump your your partner. It's pretty obvious so yeah, that obvious that you're not gonna be doing. <laughs> yeah, there's gonna be no way you're gonna assist them, so me and Tabo would just jump the shit out of you. How's that sound? I think that sounds like a fucking plan to me. Don't know what these people are saying. It's clearly not English. Go ahead and go. Powerful door. Can't do any damage, so I'm gonna set the MST. And then my turn. Alright, so it's this guy versus me and Tiago, because, like I said, that Gloria player is not gonna do much helping. Oh, yes, I face down an infinity and a Dora, so. Good fucking luck, sir. <laughs> MST or MST, that's fine. Yeah, perfectly juicy felt spell right here that you should take out. You, then, this is how you take out train. You gotta take this thing out. Like this has to be gone. Cause God, that's so powerful. Oh my God, this man is speaking not English. <laughs> so what are you gonna do, Dora? Infinity? Let's go. Like I said, your partner. No help. Fucking scrubby ass Exodia. Don't want to negate that. I could. I have no idea what he's polying into. Hmm. No, I'll humor you. What you gonna poly into? Show me what you got. Ooh. Bloom Diva. Okay. Alright, this card cannot be destroyed battle by card effects, also you take no bad damage on the top This card bound opponents monster a special limit. As your damage calculation, you can inflict damage equal to your opponent equal to the difference between this card or don't attack your opponents don't attack and you destroy the monster. Uh, as soon as you activate your effect, this is how it activates. I have no idea. And what do you do? You're talking about the expression on this card. Uh, let's see, you're gonna use your bat. And then I'll go ahead and negate you. Don't I negate? Oh, I guess I, I guess you can't be destroyed by card effects. Okay. Alright, our infinity will just eat you. Yep. <laughs> I 
Like, oh, I negate and throw you, but, you know. You uh, cannot be sure a battle record effect is a continuous effect, so. That's technically not what's activating, so I can't negate that, which is fine. It's fine. Yeah, because you got, you got eaten anyway. Yep, and then they quit. Yep. I actually got to see Bloom Dealer. Interesting. And the scrubby ass Xavier player. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it episode. It's already half an hour, so. I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels, Tango Tago. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support. And if I haven't seen you in this video, I'll see you guys tomorrow using Teller Nights. Alright, people, thanks for watching.